functional unit of organism for example unicellular organisms so unicellular organisms having independent existence okay they perform that all functions in a cell they perform all life functions in a cell okay so if anything is less than complete cell if anything if anything is not complete the cell structure it is not living it is not living that's why cell is the fundamental structural and functional unit of organism so that is known as that cell okay after that cell theory during the time of eighteen thirty eight German botanist Matthias Schleiden observed that or examined examined or observed different kinds of plants so he reported that all plants are made up of all plants are made up of different kinds of cells all so during the time of 1838 german botanist matthias schleiden examined or observed different kinds of plants okay he reported that all plants are made up of different kinds of cells to form tissues in plants to form tissues in plants so explained by that okay german botanist matthias schleiden after that german zoologist
Theodore Swan so observed different kinds of animals and he reported that since in the all animals in a cell in a animal cell animal cell cell structure in animal cell structure outer layer is thin outer thin layer is present outer thin layer is present that is known as plasma lemma plasma lemma okay so after so theodor schwann after theodor schwann concluded conclude concluded that so in all plants in all plants outside cell having cell wall so it is unique character it is unique character in plant kingdom so not only explaining of the cell membrane by theodor schwann so theodor schwann concluded that it means he conclusion that in all plants outside that cell having that cell wall so it is a unique character so it is a universal character in plant kingdom it means in all plants having that in the cell structure outside is that cell wall is present okay after that cell wall so both scientists are explained that okay cell theory both scientists are explained that all living organisms are organisms are made up of cells and products of cells and products of cells it means in all living organisms are made up of cells and products of cells okay so but they do not explain that how that okay so whole cells are arise but they do not explain how the new cells are arise so that is known as a demerit that's why they do not providing a final shape to that cell theory after that 
ருடால்ஃப் விர்ஷோ 